What's up guys, Commander Alex here, and today we are going to be playing Vox. I'm going to be playing him in the jungle. I think I'm going to be going for a weapon build as my uh, first Vox video here. So let's go for it. Got a weapon blade, have sham pots, and we'll head out here. At uh, first I was thinking I was going to go to the lane, but then uh, pedal locked in, and I figured it'd be better to have two junglers rather than two laners. So we'll just go into the jungle. Obviously Vox can jungle. Um, though I don't know how effective he is in the jungle, I haven't really tried him out in the past two. We'll give it a try, see what happens. Looks like, uh, Glaze gonna start these guys. Ooh, can I finish? We are. Glaive, I'm sorry, it took me a little while to finish those, but... Oh, he wants to invade. It's really odd, normally these camps are already taken. Well, let's say we're gonna get this one. And Glaze giving me a bunch of farm, which is really nice. I am definitely the uh, juggler that needs to get farmed the most. Glaze should be building slightly tanky, I'm, I'm thinking. There we go. Back away so it starts hitting Glaive. Yeah, he should have gotten the heal. He was, he was right to take that. And I'm going to start these guys. Pretty simple start here. Just take this guy out. There we are. Throw this out. There we go. And is he? Well, he's sort of pushed up. He's at the halfway mark. We, we definitely have a chance to possibly get a kill here. We'll have to see. Ooh, yep, he pushed up too far. Got the slow. Is it gonna be enough though? I don't think so. Oh, he's gonna get away from that one. But uh, we definitely pushed the saw out of lane. He's gonna have to either sit in this turret or he's gonna have to go back. He doesn't have much of another choice right now. We'll see. Oh, is he gonna play aggressive? If he does, that could be uh, death for him. We'll have to see. Can we go for a second weapon blade. Get a lot of base damage going, and then I'm also. Um, I don't know. I might want to go for. I want to go for a bone saw or a tornado trigger. I don't know which one I want to go for. Bone saw is a little bit more uh, utility with it, but the tornado trigger has that base attack speed that's really useful. Either way, I'm going to be going for a lot of attack speed and a lot of just base damage as well as some crits. That's I can get this uh, really cool combo. You auto attack and use my uh, first ability, and when you string them together like that, you get four auto attacks directly in a row. Let me see if I can. Ooh, that damage though. Oh, I'm playing against Omni Infinity. That's awesome. Can we kill him? Can we kill him? I want the kill. Yep, he's dead. I might be dead though. I'm in a pretty precarious position here. I'm just gonna back. Okay, works for me. I got out of that one alive somehow. Um, what do I want to go for? I've got a swift shooter, and I'm gonna go for a couple more health pops. Just in case I get taken low in the jungle, I don't want to have to go back, because uh, the less I have to go back, the more farm I can get, which is always good. See, looks like we're keeping up pretty well with the uh, with the clock here. We're a little bit behind, I'd say maybe a couple seconds behind, but we're doing pretty well as far as keeping up in the jungle. Um, let me hit this these guys so that I can use my uh, really awesome, uh, what's it called? A... Resonance, that's what it's called, guys. Sorry, I, I completely forgot like the main thing that Vox has. It's called Resonance. Um, but you can use it to farm both of those camps like together, which is kind of cool. Can't normally do that. It's really happening up there. I'm going to just hit these guys. Should we take them out, no problem. And, ooh, Vox, Vox is looking for a kill here. Are we going to give it to him? What is Omni building? Uh, Vox is building Crystal, which means that as long as he's not getting groups of enemies, he's going to be a fairly weak person to go against. Um, not not because he's a bad player, but because of his build, he works well um, in groups. That's what a crystal box is good at, and a weapon power box is good at powering down single targets. Also, weapon power box with your first ability, you can get people to have health like instantly. And just go for this. You wanna you wanna fight? No, I didn't think you wanted to fight. He's just gonna run away from me on that one. I'll pop a pot and uh, walk away. Petal should be able to farm, but Petal should get a mine in that bush up there just in case she's getting ganked. Hopefully this glaive, yes the glaive did get away. 
Uh, I don't know if I want to chase Omni, though. This could, feel, this could feel pretty bad. Oh, nope, I hit a wall. <laughs> Not going to be finishing that chase, I guess. We'll just, uh, we'll just kill this guy right here. There we are, got the heal. Oh, oh I'm kind of getting caught out here. Throw this down for a slow. Oh, I'm slow. Gonna pop a pot. And that should be enough to get out, hopefully. If he keeps chasing, I can turn on him easily. Yep, he's dead. And who do I want to go for? Pretty sure. Alright, 12 seconds till my next pot. I'm going to not go on the offensive until I have another pot um, ready to go. So I guess we'll just farm these guys up in the meantime. So nothing to worry about. What's happening over here? Let's get in a little bit. A little bit greedy, but I don't think that's going to be an issue because we have pretty good dominance right now. I'm going to go for the bone saw. I think that's uh, I think just a little bit more utility that I'm going to want, and it still has a lot of attack speed, so it shouldn't be too much of an issue. And up here, he has a level on me, but I'm not too worried about that. Yeah, see, so yeah, I can just bully him right out there. He's not even going to try and fight me. Picked up my level 6. I'll throw that down. It's not going to do a lot of damage, but it will silence him so we can't use his roadie run. And that's going to be a kill. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. That was uh, that was pretty nerdy, guys. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Wow. Ooh, I didn't know that you could jump over that wall. Mm, I'll just take this. I do know you can jump over this wall, though. So if I get caught in a bad position, I'll just jump over that wall. Ooh, Glaive. Glaive, you're getting caught. You're getting caught, bud. And he should be dead. I don't have boots, though. Oh, but it doesn't matter, because he's dead. Saw, you thought that I was going to have to chase a lot farther than I actually did. we we'll just kill these guys. And that should be... Where, where is he? There we go. Little vision glitch there, but nothing to worry about. Head down here. And I'm going to pick up my six cents and another weapon blade. That way we can start hitting our sorrow blade and our weapon blade at the same time. Wasn't paying attention though. Ooh, that silence is really, really damaging. Ooh, but the alt comes out of pedal. He gets away from that and I die because I forgot to pop a pot. I definitely could have lived there if I popped a pot. That was stupid of me. Doesn't matter though. We're three and one. Not doing too poorly here. This is... Uh, actually, I have played a good few games with Fox because I was streaming last night. And, uh, and I played a couple games there. I also did some shoutcasting, guys. I'm really looking forward to doing that. Uh, if you guys don't know what it is, it's basically where you are a third party viewing a game and you just uh, talk about what's happening, basically. And it's, it's a ton of fun. I really enjoyed it. And uh, I got up to, I think, 30 viewers at one point. Or maybe, actually, when I got a Beard Bond, my playoff beard, he uh, sent everybody over my stream. I got like up to like 50 viewers at a time, which is really, really cool. So... Uh, I'm definitely going to be doing more shout casting in the future. There we are. That guy's dead. What's happening up here? Vox, you could still be a real issue. Oh, you did get silence. Yes. The slow comes out. Is it going to be enough? Oh, I don't think it's going to be enough. Oh, I should have jumped into the bush. Yep, I'm dead. I'm dead. I should have uh, used my second ability into a bush rather than and into uh, the fire of saw that was dumb that was really dumb actually I'm starting to throw this game we gotta get back on point here what do we got, got, got going here I'm thinking boots would be a good thing to have we'll buy those I'm gonna head down here I'm gonna leave my minion mine uh, I don't know why Glade took his minion mine but there's really no point in doing it so uh, that's just gonna end up helping us get a little bit extra farm and uh, hopefully it's gonna help us win lane because if we lose the lane, then uh, it's going to be a pretty hard game for me. Especially because I cannot take a lot of damage. I uh, am more of a damage dealer right now. Anyway, farm up our jungle here. Just work through it. Oop, there we are. I completely kind of stole that because he should have taken the heal. But it's okay. It's not too big of a deal. And can't buy anything. Head over here. Oh, he's going to get away from that one. Or is he? Is he going to try and turn around on me? Oh, 
Oh, oh, the single power damage is too much. Oh, man. I'm getting shut down now. I was doing really well, and I just, I'm falling off big time. I don't know what's happening with me, but it's just, uh, the kills are not coming. Let's see how Omni's doing. Uh, looks like he's 2 and 3, so he's a little bit, a little bit worse than me KD-wise, but, uh, he's definitely coming back. That saw should not be sticking around. The saw can easily be ganked right there. Even under turret, Glaive could dive him. I'm going to pick up the second ability on my alt, or the second point on my alt there. Let's just farm up our jungle here. And this, is, I think, is what I'm going to do to begin with here. I'm just going to get a bunch of farm really quickly, and then maybe I'll go for kills late game. But early game, I just want to get farm. I just want to build my items and not die. Which is not what I'm doing. go. Oh, Glaive. Nope. Missed your ult, dude. If he landed the ult, I might have actually died there because I wouldn't have been able to get out, but uh, he didn't, so that's good. Got my bone saw. Shoot quickly. Deplete armor. That means that if they try building armor against me, it's not going to work. And that's basically what I want to have, which is going to force them to most likely um, either build a bunch of health, which is pretty easy for me to work through, or they're going to have to build um, shield which is really not going to help them against me anyway boom there we go yeah we did earn it i was like no omni you can't steal that did i silence anybody i don't know oh we got the finish there is this going to be enough is it going to be enough i don't think it's going to be enough we can back away from that one We'll just finish these guys off here. I'm gonna walk in this bush. Anybody in here? Nope. Glaive's just chilling at his turret. It looks like. Yep. I'm gonna I'm gonna leave them alone and I'm gonna farm up their jungle here. I am gonna leave their minion mine though because I want our team to uh, stay ahead in gold and XP. Speaking of XP, there has been a change. If you are ahead in XP, then you actually uh, gain XP slower, and if you're behind in XP, then you gain XP faster. So. Um, it's harder to snowball now, basically, as far as levels go. You can't just farm up to level 12 and hit level 12 when everyone else is, like, level 2. Okay, maybe not level 2, but, uh, you know, you can't just farm levels high above everybody else and then, um, just expect that to carry you through the game. It just won't anymore. What's happening up here? I'm gonna head up and, uh, see if we can bully out on the infinity here. Oh, Saad's, Saad does a lot of damage to me. Yes, Glaive, good job, good job. Nope, don't want to die. <laughs> on the bright side, we did uh, end up killing Saad there, because he went way too deep to try and get the kill onto me. I should be conscientious of Saad's uh, stacks, though. I don't want to go in when he's fully spun up. I want to wait for Glaive to punt him to uh, reset his stacks, and then I want to go in. Just a little note. There we go. Hey, why am I taking damage? How does that make sense? I'll give you a little hint. It doesn't make sense. Oh, that all. Oh, why did I walk into that? I was not meaning to do that. I'm gonna. Bo I'm just walking away from this one. I don't want to die. And go for the heavy steel. Working towards a sorrow blade. I'm also gonna go for tension bow. And where's that heal bow? Where are you? There you are, heal buff. There we go, got that one. Gonna get the top one as well. Easy peasy. And I'll push him off the turret, because Glaive is getting uh, kind of annoying. Let's see. Glaive's sticking around. He is, but I could easily, easily kill myself here. I'm going to have to be very smart about this one. Oh, no. I was not playing that smart. Boots, boots. Why did I not hit my boots? Ah, I misclicked. That was bad. Uh, we'll pick up another weapon blade. Let's see what the enemy team's building here. We got Vox on their team building crystal. A weapon power saw and a weapon power glaive. Honestly, I'm not too afraid of their Vox 
Even though Sal only has one kill, I'm more afraid of him. So I'm going to build a... Uh, actually, do they have any... They don't have any armor pierce except for the tension bow. So I'm going to go for some armor. That is once I finish up my... Uh, my sorrow blade, that's what it's called. Once I finish that up, I'll have a spot. Just move down here. Easy, easy. And uh, I'm going to end up maxing my alt and my first ability rather than maxing my first and second ability or my second ability and alt just because my, uh, my second ability really only works well with crystal power. It, uh, increases the damage that your resonance bounces do and since i'm not really focusing on resonance bounces i don't really have to worry about that oh oh buddy no why did you punt him out of my alt why would you do that oh silly silly glee on both sides um should i just go back no nah, i'll come back down here and i'll buy my sorrow blade there we go and sorrow blade. There we are. Very nice. Very nice. Don't don't take that. Don't take that. They're taking it. Okay. Well, can't stop them. Push this guy out. Here we are. And ooh, Vox is gankable. Yep, he's dead. Can I get the saw though? That's the real question here. Oh, Glaive just punted me into saw. I'm dead. That was in, that was well done by Glaive. If he hadn't punted me there, I would have been able to dance around saw and kill him. But Glaive got me right into his suppressive fire, and I just didn't stand a chance. That was well well played. Well played. Uh, I'm gonna get a six sins, and I don't have enough gold to work on my to work on my metal jacket. So that sucks. On the right side, Saw still is not building any armor pierce. Uh, nor is Glaive except for his tension bow, which... Tension bows do give you a little bit of armor pierce, correct? Let me check this. Yeah, 15%. So, um, not a ton, but enough that it's going to make a difference. Anyway, we're 5, 5, and 5. If we can uh, increase all of our stats by 1, then we would be the devil's number. That'd be a funny way to end a video, I guess. Omnifity is going to be a lot more of a threat late game though because he's building a crystal box which really scales well as time goes on because you're going to get into team fights and uh, team fights mean people are grouped up and that means that resonance is going to be a lot more useful. Good alt on his part there. Head over here, throwing down my alt. That should be death right there. Oh yes, did pick up the kill. That's good. We got a we got an ace. Go for the kraken. Go for the kraken. I don't know what the heck Glaive's doing. Either way, this should be an easy, easy game. As long as Pedal tanks. Pedal, what are you doing? Tank with your munions. Be smart. Seriously. All right, I'm going to sit over here just in case. Yep, that's it. That is the Kraken. That should be a couple turrets for us as well. going to pick up the uh, Piercing Spear. What else do I want to go for? Oh, a little bit of lag there. Not appreciating that. No, thank you, Vainglory. And up here, ooh, we just need to get one more death. And we can, do I want to go for another death just so that we can level this all off and get the devil's number, guys? Do we want to go for the 666 finish? Is it worth it? I think it might actually be worth it. We'll see. If if the game is sealed, then I might go for uh, the final death. Throw that out. There we go. I'm going to chase this one. He's dead. Can we get the finish? No, 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 we can't. <laughs> the answer to that question is a no. And we already got a uh, kill and an assist, so no longer going to go and kill myself. Sad. Sad, sad, sad. Oh, look at that damage that I do. There we are. Another kill. We're finishing strong here, guys. Picking up kills left and right throughout my alt. Did a little bit of damage there, and this should be game. Anybody going to be up for them? Pedal on... Or Vox is going to come up, but uh, I don't think it's going to be enough. I think that's going to be game. Just throw out my pulse, because I can. Hop over here. Ooh, 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 baby. Anyway, 
that was game guys i hope you enjoyed if you did be sure to leave a like comment and subscription and tell me if you i or a either have vox or b are going to be getting vox when he comes out for a glory unlocks he's really fun and i uh, really want to see what you guys have to say about him so tell me in the comments down below and become a lieutenant today see ya